by way of spectacular knockout, the Bronze Bomber, Deontay Wilder! In this video, we will dissect the skills of one of the deadliest knockout artists in boxing history, Deontay Wilder. He impresses with a stunning record of 42 wins, 41 of which came by means of knockout and only two losses. Wilder's monstrous strength, combined with great speed for a heavyweight, which amplifies his already powerful shots, is a problem for anyone who faces him in the ring. He is a boxer that can inflict damage even through the opponent's gloves. If you stand still against Wilder, chances are you're getting knocked out. And this is precisely what makes him into such a dangerous fighter. He doesn't possess textbook technique, but his attacks are extremely efficient. He is one of the best finishers in the sport and when he senses that his opponent is hurt, he immediately goes for the kill. That's why we can't give him anything but 5 stars for this kill. The biggest perks of Wilder's defense are his sense of distance and his reflexes. Most of the time he's at the perfect range to keep opponents at bay while being one step away from landing his own strikes. Until recently, the strategy was successful because his opponents gave his powerful striking too much respect. But all of this changed when Fury figured out how Wilder can be dismantled in the first meeting of their epic trilogy. It became clear that the Bronze Bomber feels uncomfortable when he's put on the back foot. His footwork and power suffer as a result, and he can't hit his signature one too due to the lack of inertia. Since the beginning of his career, Deontay's defense isn't remarkable. And looking at it today, it doesn't seem much improved. The reason being is that he almost never had to use it just KO anyone standing in front of him. It's pretty common for Wilder to lower his hands when exchanging blows or when he's put under pressure, which makes hitting hooks on him easy for skilled boxers, as long as they have the necessary reach and sense of distance. He tries to provoke his adversaries by leaving himself open for shots, but oftentimes that tactic doesn't work out for him. We can even see Deontay reaching forward in an attempt to push his opponent while defending himself, which gets him in trouble and is very uncommon in high-level boxing. That made the difference in their last two fights with Fury. He was on the defensive for a large portion of the match and carried Fury's weight during the rest of it, which drained his energy and led to two heavy defeats. Considering his physical capabilities, if Deontay Wilder had his boxing fundamentals down from an early age, developed a good defense as other boxers of the same rank, he would easily be one of the most feared champions in the boxing world as a whole. We give his defense 3.5 stars. If you like our content and want to support the channel, please do it by hitting the like and subscribe buttons. Thanks! When Wilder smells blood, he turns into a ruthless killer and a dominant brawler. But he does so smart and at the right time. He's able to read the movements of other fighters 
keep them at an ideal distance for himself and attack ferociously when the time comes. When Lawler gets the chance to dictate how a fight goes, he is in full control. His decision making is sound and that makes it so that he rarely leaves his comfort zone. But when he does, things go out really fast and he seems unable to adapt to the situation. Often when he's under pressure, he's off balance, he doesn't close distance to his opponents and he doesn't protect his chin that well. Overall, Wilder is able to dominate easier fights while struggling to change his style when put under pressure. It's worth noting that his confidence and winner mentality helps him to push forward and perform to the best of his abilities. Our score for his ring IQ is 4 stars. Wilder puts a lot of effort into his training and that is pretty obvious on the ring. Gifted with amazing physique, he always comes out well prepared, full of energy, fast and powerful. You know, I'm, I'm a super hard worker, worker but uh, when I have somebody just as passionate about what I'm doing, it takes me, it makes me want to go to that level, it makes me want to see how far can I go. Considering that most of his matches are over pretty quickly, we cannot determine his endurance level for sure. Wilder is lighter than most of his peers in the division, which is an advantage when he's allowed to move freely in the ring. His last matches showed that it can be a weakness as well, when he was forced to carry his opponents around. Even then, at the brink of exhaustion, he was able to land some heavy punches. He doesn't shy away from battle and gives 100%. Considering all of this, we believe Deontay's endurance is at a very high level and we decided to give his engine 4 stars. The Bronze Bomber is one of the most spectacular fighters of our time and we always look forward to his next appearance on the ring. Let us know your score for Deontay, how do you rate him in the heavyweight division and who do you want us to rate next. See you soon. Thank you.